You spend too much time roaming the monastery. Oh yeah? If you're looking for something, try less aimless wandering. What are you, a commenter? Hello everyone, welcome to the 12th episode of our Fire Emblem Three Houses Let's Play. In the last episode, we did the Chapter 3 battle against Lenato. We had some uh, fun and interesting stuff happen with how that went down. I did something kind of messed up to finish it all off, but you'll have to go back and see if you missed it. In this episode, we're going to be exploring the monastery in this fourth month with brand new dialogue and stuff. I'll definitely try to cut out as much as I can, because uh, there's going to be a lot of talking and stuff like that, and exploring the monastery once again in this fourth month of the game. But without further ado, let's get back to it. It's also currently 5 a.m. in the morning, so forgive me, but uh, I'm just uh, being a little crazy, I guess. I couldn't help it. I just didn't want to go to bed. I wanted to keep playing. I'm so far behind in this game that I just wanted to kind of catch up as much as I can, and I just want to experience more. I'm, t I'm tired of putting it off. I'm tired of not being able to play, so let's do it. Definitely exploring the monastery like the 100% of other people. <laughs> Seems like kind of a low-key month. There's not that many events that I saw happening. We got Sothis here again, too. A hero's relic. I kind of feel like she wouldn't like me telling her what it is. However, could I know there we something? go. Still, it is heavy on my mind. Hmm. The stone within the sword. A glow of red. Crest stone. Hmm? Oh, it is nothing. Yeah, so there is a distinction between crests that people inherently have uh, as part of their bloodline and crest stones, which appear to power up those uh, heroes' relics. But that's about all we know from uh, knowing the trailers and stuff. Okay, we got some quests here from Dimitri. Let's do this. Whoa, okay. He's always in here, huh? enemy's aim lies elsewhere we had better discern their true intent quickly as I see it our best option is to explore every inch of the monastery we should also speak to everyone here let's plan to compare notes once you've got a lead curious will you do me a favor talk to people in the monastery to help figure out the enemy's true aim okay okay so this must be those investigation quests that people were saying kind of kind of bop you on the nose a bit I guess with information What's that? Ah, that is that belongs to uh, Dadu because he was standing here last month. I hear you have fought alongside Catherine. I would wager that her power exceeded your expectations. Well, I mean, yeah, Had she's got a chance to witness her busted relic. brave sword. Thunderbrand, glowing yeah. red. That glow is a sure sign that her blood contains a crest that harmonizes with that hero's relic. I don't know, dude. She was missing a lot. <laughs> she missed a lot of shots. She did crit a lot though, too. To be fair. Let's see. Okay, so let's, um, there's a lot to do here. I'm just going to head north initially. I see some stuff up here. Try to start knocking out some of these conversations. Is that Mercy? I see Mercy. Uh, that's, that's, um, Lawrence's because he was over here last time. What's this? Oh, hey, Professor. I was just reading this letter from my father. Do you know him? He's a pretty big deal in the Empire. Nah. He only writes to ask how my training's going, or how many monsters I've killed, stuff like that. I think if I remember right, he's got an older brother that's actually inheriting, um, you know, everything from his family, and that's why hey, he's here in the monastery. Uh, speak to the tournament. Oh, okay. Actually, there's a... Why did I not realize that there was a tournament happening? Or is that just because of the quest right now? Cool. All right, that's not you. Let's talk to Mercy. Look at that view. It's pretty. It's also pretty deadly, isn't it? The monastery holds many treasures. Maybe the enemy is after one of those? Even so, the idea of stealing from a church is just horrible. <laughs> Come on, Mercy. She's just like too sweet. Too sweet. Okay. We got some seeds. It would be nice to find some bait, because I kinda used all the bait last month. Ah, that's Marianne, because she was here. I've heard talk of students wandering the monastery late at night. They wouldn't happen to be from your class, would they? <laughs> Please keep your students in line, Professor. Kids these days. It's gotta be Sylvain. 
That's so funny. I love that there's little touches like that, you know? Hmm. Setting fire to the stables to distract everyone. To cause a commotion. What? It is the oldest trick in the book. But I cannot shake the thought that our enemies may attempt it. I will stand guard and watch over the stable. And the knight's horses. They are truly magnificent. It's pretty smart, Ferdinand. I'll give you that. Please, do me a favor. Who wants a tea set? Huh. Who loves tea? Oh, Hubert. It's gotta be Hubert. I think Hubert likes... Well, actually, he likes coffee, I think. Don't ask me why I know that. Gatekeeper. So, greetings, Professor. Nothing to report. Yet. The goddess's rite of rebirth is this month, right? The monastery gates will be thrown wide open on that day. I'll be working as a guide. I hope I get to guide some lovely ladies around. <laughs> Is that... That's Sylvain in that helmet. I should have known. No. Yeah, that's for uh, Hilda. She was here last time. It's pretty easy to remember where the students were because um, you almost kind of get attached to their locations since you're wandering the monastery right. quite a bit each month. All right. Um, do we need any? Let's um what do you refresh require? some battalions here. Actually, only hers. Like, well, I guess it's only four. We might as well just auto do it. Cool. Okay. Farewell. Um, I'll consider hiring some later. I don't really want to go sit here too long. Let's get to these quests, huh? All right. I like bait because I used all my bait. Manuela. Hey. Curious spot this month. Professor, I hope you're well. As for me, I had a date with a splendid specimen of a knight. But now he's suddenly not in the mood to oh, see me poor again. Manuela. I blame all these rumors of a deathly figure showing up in town. Such an uproar must have, beyond reason, drawn his attention away from me. Oh, absolutely. That's what it is, yes. Yes, of course, my dear. I might want to waifu Manuela this this playthrough. I don't know. We'll see what happens. The goddess's rite of rebirth is the most significant ritual for the Church of Seros. Could it be that someone has spread these rumors of an assassination plot merely with the intention to hinder the celebration? Okay, you... I don't know. Do you like tea? I'm not sure, but this is yours. Oh, most kind. Thank you for bringing this to me. Actually, they should have removed it from his model. It would have been kind of funny. But I guess you lose a hint then, kind of. It means he has multiple fake flowers, though, which Maybe. is pretty funny. It would be terrible if the greenhouse was targeted. The plants in here are incredibly valuable. This place contains the heart of Garrick Mach's 995-year history. So many beautiful flowers. Plants that can save or end lives. They are all my precious children. Hmm. Someone actually pointed out, I think it was on Twitter, that these flowers are corpse flowers. Which seems oddly specific to have here in the greenhouse as a part of the monastery. Kind of an interesting little detail. I bet you they did that on purpose. Okay, let's check on our crop though. I think we planted something else. I'm just looking for any extra items. Yeah. Just kind of a lot of random stuff. I was hoping to get like a little bit more than that or something, but. Like, I'm not even sure. Should I like wait till a good month? Uh, like that specifically has a farming event for me to plant some of these like five star things? I don't know, but like, I'm really, t oh, there's flower seeds. Oh, we're doing this. That way, next time we'll have something for Petra. And I'm gonna... You know, it'd be nice to see... Oh, okay, so it does actually change the yield eventually. It just doesn't at first. Um, I, I don't... Let's just do this one. I don't actually know like what the difference is between those couple of ranks because there's not really a visual representation there. Alright, um, someone's here? Oh, you are the team man, aren't you? Is right. Could it be the... 
How kind of you. I will have to repay you sometime. Okay, cool. That's pretty nice. Oh, okay, tea time. I've, I've never experienced tea time before. I'm actually kind of avoided people playing it too. I've seen screenshots, so I kind of know a little bit about how it works, but I've never actually done it myself. I heard it's actually pretty hard, even if you do know the character pretty well, because you have to pick the right options. Um, okay, so I do know that some of the students' rooms can have items in them too, so I'm just going to really quickly check all the rooms here. I'll probably just cut this part out. There's so many little nooks and crannies of the monastery that you'll need to check each month. I guess it's not the biggest deal because you can always um, come back another week, but you know. Um, hi. Such a shut in, Bernadetta. Right now is, um, well, right now is okay, I guess. If you uh, want to chat a little. No, oh, she's like slightly opening hi. up. I get hungry sometimes, like anyone else. What? Eating at night is bad for you. <laughs> There's no way that's true. Wait, really? <laughs> Let's make sure to go here. Oh, look at that. You spend too much time roaming the monastery. Oh, yeah? If you're looking for something, try less aimless wandering. What are you, a commenter? Do you even know who the enemy is? You can't know why without knowing who. It's none of my business anyway. I'm just here to take care of enemies who get too close. She's, um... Kind of edgy. I like her. This poor dude. That's so. Just wandering up here for months on end. Doesn't know what to do with his life. I feel for you, bro. Let's see. Okay, so that dude being here must mean, yeah, that's the tournament organizer. Ha! Huh. Thunderbrand replica. Obviously, uh, Catherine. Awarded for graduation from the Garrick Mock Officers Academy. It probably belongs to a graduate. Who else was standing in here that was a graduate? Not Hubert. Or, it's not you, is it? You're skilled. Why won't you battle me? <laughs> Any choices there? No. Sending an assassin to the monastery, hmm? Hopefully it's someone worth crossing blades with. It seems we're cut from the same cloth. Of course. <laughs> Always wants the uh, very fight-related dialogues. Um, you know, I want to do... Let's do, let's do it. I want to do this. Let's see. Current one will focus on sword skills. Rely on allies who are proficient with swords. Recommended level 6 or higher. Yeah, with the training sword. Okay, I'm, I'm a little nervous about sending Felix only because of his defense, but he is the best sword rank we've got. You know what? Yeah, prove yourself, Felix. Let's um see what you got. Look at all those skills compared to this random kid. This poor kid. Next time, bring your friends. Is that it? Just one? Or are there multiple rounds to this? Oh yeah, okay. Cool. This is kind of like the arena of this game. Right? Another win. <laughs> Just instant. Goodbye. It's, it's not even fair. You're too good, Felix. <laughs> Barely even taking any damage. What was Next I even worried about? How long does this go for? Alright, that one hurt. Why am I even here? Okay, we're starting to actually fight people with um actual stuff here. I think we can live this one. Why am I even here?
no heals. No heals necessary. Nice, Steel Sword Plus, okay. And you won that fair and square, so that'll be your Steel Sword. I'm glad I asked you. Oh, we got a Steel Axe for that too, nice. Got some good stuff there. Uh, we also have some supports that I guess I ignored. Uh, we got a Felix support. I thought I heard someone. Are you here to train? Care to train with me? Waving the sword around alone is boring. And I'm tired of crossing swords with worthless opponents. <laughs> so, but you so seem blunt. like a worthy adversary. I've always been interested in your technique. You learned from the former captain of the Knights of Seros, and traveled Fodlin fighting as a mercenary. Good sparring partners like you don't grow on trees. But know that I will beat you, and I will surpass your strength. Why? Hmm. I never really thought about that. I learned to thrust a sword before I learned to write my name. Of course, my upbringing wasn't unique. That's how it is for all children in my country. You're no use if you can't swing a sword, however mighty your crest may be. So he did actually learn. It seems like he had an older brother um, who actually died in the same event that Dimitri's parents died in four years ago. So I wonder if he wants to get stronger because of that event happening, if that kind of changed him. It was the perfect environment It'd be some for interesting me. development with that. I could live free of stodgy values and virtues. Grow strong so you may live, and live to grow stronger. That's what I was taught. Mm. Why should I? Nothing's as important as the pursuit of strength. But that's enough, idle chatter. Take out your sword. My mind is emptied of all but the thrill of the challenge. <laughs> Nice. Alright, oh, Dimitri and Dadu. Here we go. Your Highness, the hour is late. May I ask where it is you're going? I'm off to the library for a bit of research before I train. After that, a bath and bed. Very well. I shall accompany you. Uh, no. There's no need for that. I am a grown man, after all. You sustained an injury during yesterday's training. My presence may be of use to you. It was a mere bruise that will heal in no time. No need to fret over me, Dudu. Are you dissatisfied with me, Your Highness? Please do not hesitate to correct me. And there it is again. Yes? What is it? <laughs> Look at his face. He's so concerned. Well, you often choose to address me as Your Highness. When we first met, you used to call me by my name. That was because I was unfamiliar with Fodlin's speech. Thinking back, such rude manners were inexcusable. To be honest, I much preferred it. I feel more comfortable being addressed by my name, rather than with the honorifics that go along with being a prince. But... I did not teach you to read and write so that you'd know how to address me properly. And I brought you to the Academy as my friend, not a vassal. But your highness, a vassal is precisely what I am. So much has happened since we met, yet we cannot seem to bridge this gap. So be it. I give you leave to return to your quarters. Take an early night and reflect on what I've said. Please. I couldn't possibly. I said I would accompany you, did I not? True. But I would much prefer that we take steps to ease this mindset of yours. Hmm. <laughs> Very interesting. Ah, Dimitri and Ash. Let's talk about killing your your dad. Mm, this tent is torn. Can you please fix this one first, Ash? Absolutely. Sorry. I should probably take care of it myself, but we'd be here until sundown if I... No problem at all. I've had lots of practice with things like this. Happy to help however I can. Oh. Well, thanks. Actually... I'll fetch you something to make the job less of a burden. You like sweet things, right? Ah, uh, well, yes. Sorry, no, I can't ask you to do that. 
Ash, I told you, there's no need to act like that. I, I can't have someone from the royal family running errands for me. It doesn't feel right. I really don't mind, so you needn't worry about that. And while I'm being candid, I'd prefer it if you didn't speak so formally to me. We're supposed to be allies. We fought side by side as equals, haven't we? I know. But to commoners like me, you're royalty. Regular folks normally only lay eyes on someone like you once or twice in their whole lives. I understand. I really do. When I ascend the throne, perhaps I should do a tour of each city. What? No, that's not what I meant. I'm at a loss. I wish to make things better, but I seem to only upset you more and more. That is certainly not my intention. Perhaps I should leave you be and take care of our shopping. Please, I promise I'll go myself just as soon as I finish with the tent. Ash, enough! Okay. I have a question. Answer me this. I don't normally eat sweets. So what would you recommend? Oh, well... If price isn't a concern for you, then you should go for the sugar candies. The ones they make in town are really delightful. How about the, how about some chocolate, bro? Where's the chocolate? Uh, oh, your highness, please, you mustn't. Got it. Sugar candies it is. I'll go and fetch some. Your highness, please come back. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'll, I'll, <laughs> I'll make sure these repairs get done. Oh, Ash. <laughs> Ash and Sylvain. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Wow, Ash. Training again? You're taking this whole night thing pretty seriously. It's just my daily training. Maybe you could stand to be a little more eager yourself? If I want to be a great knight, I've got no choice but to put the effort in. No choice? I think you're making life too difficult. Knights don't have to be perfect. All I'm saying is I've seen some pretty sloppy knights out there. That's not going to be me. I'm going to be a proud knight, virtuous and gallant. Virtuous and gallant? Are you kidding me? If you just ride around being virtuous, people will get fed up. They'll boot you out of town. It's never wrong to have virtue, not even if it means being made an outcast. Interesting idea. You think very highly of this whole virtue thing. Say. Have there been any knights who became great just by thinking highly of themselves? Think on this. Knights are supposed to protect people and earn their admiration. Isn't that right? Well, yes. So what are you saying I should do? Seize people's hearts! <laughs> Get ladies! What do you mean? You want people to love you? Offer them something they haven't got. Guess what that is? It's you, Ash. They don't have you. Get out there, buddy. Be valiant. Help people. Here, I'll show you how it works. Uh, Sylvain, don't go bothering people. Hey there, cutie. You seem to have lots <laughs> of bags there. They must be heavy. My name's Sylvain. Let me help you out. Are these going in the warehouse? Uh, have you met Ash? Helping out those in need. I guess that's a good start. No thanks necessary. It's been enough just to be able to talk to you. Well, if you insist. How about we go get some tea? <laughs> it must be fate that we met like this. Such a bro. I'd like to get to know you. Great knight, huh? More like a great philanderer. Seems like all he wants to do is flirt with women. No, I can't allow this. I have to stop him. <laughs> Alright, it's gonna be helpful to know who has no supports with anybody. So like Dudu and Felix, yeah, Dudu with a lot of people. I haven't really gotten any supports with him. Um, yeah, Ash. Pretty much everybody with everybody still. Dimitri has a good amount at this point. He's missing Felix though still. That's gotta be worked on. And Violet actually. Um, this is, I don't know, like why do we have, I guess he just has those? I'm not really sure why these two are in here. What is this? Ah, we got Lauren's support. Cool. Let's get back to these quests. I bet the enemy is using this assassination nonsense just to sneak in and raid the pantry. Oh yeah, huh? What do you think, Professor? Oh, I'm right, all right. 
My animal instinct is telling me that the enemy is after our best meats. You're actually sitting down and doing classwork? That is so unlike you. Oh, actually, you look kind of sad. Is it true you got caught in the fighting? I'm so thankful you made it out alive. I don't know what we would do if we lost you. I'm not your teacher. That's sweet, though. Oh, have you been tasked with guarding the monastery as well? Such a stir over a single letter. But I suppose the Archbishop's safety is too important to risk. Okay, that was Ferdinand here, yeah. So that one, that one's him. We'll have to loop back around and get Ferdinand. Anybody here? Oh yeah. Someone's in the classroom. There you are. The monks declined my offer of assistance. They said that no one from Dusker is to be trusted, especially now. Ouch. Given the circumstances, I cannot fault them. Poor to do. You're gonna like this though. That belongs to me. I apologize for the trouble. There's been talk of an attempt on Rhea's life. We've been ordered to help the Knights patrol. Could that possibly mean that Rhea isn't beloved by everyone the world over? It seems there were forces opposing the Church beyond Lord Lamato. I never thought such forces could exist in this world. Maybe the Church isn't the best. Uh, what's she gonna like, though? I suppose that yeah, may okay. be true. This is yours, is it not? No, that's not you. It is... This. Yes, this is mine. Thank you for returning it. Um, that's gonna be it for here. I spy an item. Appreciated by everyone, I see. What is this? Professor. Lawrence. Professor, I understand that you were looking to speak with me. Perhaps you would like some insight on how to write your next lecture? I can't believe we got his support. While I do have a great many Hedgehog's ideas, support. it would be inappropriate to... Oh, am I mistaken? If that's the case, then what can I do for you? Uh -oh. The ladies have complained to you about me. <laughs> Preposterous. <laughs> there must be some mistake. <laughs> I am the heir of the noble house Gloucester. It is bred in me to treat all people with respect. Rest assured, you will not find anyone more upstanding than yours truly. Perhaps the issue is that the splendor of my noble presence is driving the ladies to distraction. Yes, definitely. If that is the That's crime, the I do confess. I hope I've not troubled the ladies' hearts unduly. Outrageous! That's absurd! Who would dare to allege such slander? <laughs> A number of female students, actually. <laughs> of all the... <sighs> what are you doing, well, dude? I suppose I have offered several of them the honor of dining with me. It is impossible to tell if even the most well-bred young lady is a suitable companion for me, merely by the sight of her. So, in order for us to get to know each other properly, it is appropriate that we dine together. Thus far, they have all declined, oddly enough. For some reason, they seem to be exercising some form of restraint when speaking with me. I would never insist, of course. But I will admit I have, on occasion, after a day's pause, issued repeat invitations in the fashion and style of a gentleman. Of course. Naturally. What? Ridiculous! Dinner invitations for me? A problem? The very idea. I am a perfect gentleman, the son of a noble line. I have a wit like a rapier, and it takes but a glance to see that I'm gorgeous. <laughs> no, I cannot believe such a thing. Are you sure this isn't the result of some sort of scheme? It cannot be otherwise. Someone has clearly devised a conspiracy against me. Of course. Someone who envies my position, who seeks to soil my sterling reputation with foul rumors. How crude. Please, Professor, it is beneath you to fall victim to such petty and obscene tactics. I implore you to take greater care in the future. Now, if you will excuse me, I have a great deal of work to do. Farewell.
Gerald's. What's the matter? You're running all over creation. Ah, you don't believe Lady Rhea is the real target, do you? Even so, the knights have their orders. We can't abandon our duty to guard Lady Rhea. You better watch your the back, Gerald. The goddess's rite of rebirth is an important event for the Church of Seros. They say it's the day when the goddess will return to walk among us. Not too likely, if you ask me. Uh, best if you keep that to yourself. <laughs> I love him. He's such, a, he's such a good character. I really hope you don't die, buddy. But I have no faith. Intelligence system's too evil. With the parent killing. Um, is there anything? Head chef challenge. Um, okay. Okay, so what we're gonna do here, we are... There's actually not even any arrows this time to select who's here. And I think this gives a full motivation bar boost. So, um, doing somebody... I think we have... Let me just take a look. I want to see the supports between... Yeah, you've got a C with everybody, actually, except for Felix. How about Ash? Who are you missing? Ash is missing to do and Felix. Oh, Ash and Mercedes could actually, or Annette. I definitely want to have my students at max motivation for instruction. So let's do Annette and Ash. Eating alone is nice, but I think I prefer eating with a friend. Somehow everything tastes better with company. <laughs> Their whole conversation was like the same with each other. I thought it went, okay, maybe I'm wrong. Thought I gave more than that, but especially for the head. Okay, so that was that. Weird. <laughs> I bought the ingredients for making some sweet treats. I can't wait to eat. Huh? Oh, uh, I know it looks like I'm fooling around, but I'm not. I'm preparing for potential battle during my patrol by making sure I have plenty of food I can eat while walking. Smart, huh? <laughs> I know. Once they're ready, I promise to share some with you. Very sweet. Also very potent and dangerous. Would not want to fight her. So, okay, we're looking for um, someone who graduated. Hilda, Ferdinand, I know where he is, and Catherine. In terms of lost items. Here's another NPC for that quest. Something in the monastery that someone might go after? There's so much here, I couldn't possibly name just one. Even this here kitchen contains precious wares. Wine bottles from centuries past and the like. I hear that stuff is fancy, but not very drinkable. I doubt anyone would go to the trouble of stealing it. Who do we have? Oh my god, look at this. Linhart, falling asleep on the floor, I guess. So sleepy. Too sleepy. I found an interesting book in the library. Got so caught up reading it, I forgot to sleep. Of course. Interesting discovery, though. The coffins of the four saints in the sanctum each have their crests carved into them. I'll need to find a way down there to get a look. I have a feeling we'll end up down there later in this month. I've been in town procuring some supplies for Flame. Why do you care about his Flame? Nothing out of the ordinary. Do not trouble yourself over it. Hmm. I have something to ask of you. You wouldn't happen to be a graduate of I've been in town. I'm sorry to say. I okay. Anything here? Oh yeah, we do have Ferdinand over here, so let's get that out of the way. Setting fire to the it, it, I will stand. Tea leaves. Oh, I was looking for this. Thank you so much. There's Hilda. Hilda and Sylvain. What a perfect combo right there. Somehow I don't think it would work out though. Did you know that on the last day of the rite, the monastery's open to the general public? It's kind of fun. It makes the place feel like a festival. You lost some perfume. Oh, you found 
found it. Thank you so, so much. You're a sweetheart. She talks to me like she talks to all the other white knight orbiters surrounding her. No classes on a festival day. I thought I'd get to spend all day relaxing in the company of some lovely ladies. But now this mess has happened. Hey, Professor, I know there's talk of an assassination attempt, but do you really think they'll do it on the day of the Rite of Rebirth? I feel like security would be looser some other time. Is there some reason why it has to happen on that day? Interesting. There's probably some truth to that, too. All right, well, you definitely didn't graduate Hello. yet. Hey, it's Petra. Assassinations are many. <laughs> Fighting to stop a murdering is my specialness. Uh, no, my specialty. I will show my best work. Of course. We're gonna give you a gift. How about an owl feather? This is giving me great joy. Oh, she really liked that. I didn't know you could get double, double up arrows on that. Um, and you're definitely not graduated. Training has given butt. Yeah. Okay. I would like to recruit you still. Look at that peg knight. Really? It's kind of dangerous to be flying so close no. over here, huh? Watch out for the church. Can you imagine the archbishop being murdered? I prefer not to consider such a gruesome scenario. Wouldn't you like that? That easy to get under your skin, uh. is it? <laughs> oh well. Not trying to recruit you, so that's fine. Is this actually closed today? Ah, okay. Let me in. That reminds me. People seem to think that all the Knights of Seros are equal, but that isn't quite so. There are many distinguishing ranks within the Order. For example, there are squires who are training to become knights, as well as full knights, like myself. Oh, and then we have the holy knights, such as Catherine. Those are the knights that can wield a hero's relic. Listen. Squire. You listen, kid. Weren't you being scolded the other month down the hall? The goddess's home is in the sky. She lives on a bright and shining star. But in the spring, you can't see that star. That means she can't protect Borden. Okay, kid. That's why Go we finish your Cheerios. That's the day when her star returns to the sky. That's the day of the rite of rebirth. See? See? I've been studying. I know just about everything. Okay, kid. That's enough of that. That reminds me. Well, as a priest. About 20 or so years ago, there was a big fire in Garrig Mach. On that day, Captain Geralt went yep. missing. Everyone thought he was dead. It never occurred to me that he might actually have survived. The truly strange part is that in all those years, he hasn't changed a Yeah, this seems to imply like maybe Geralt is actually already dead or something happened with him that it, it's kind of weird. They keep saying this and implying it. Two notes, let's get it. Uh, it's Dorothea, even if I find love, I won't be able to live without money. Um. Maybe, maybe this one? You only need money to survive? No. That's one, that, this one's sweet, but... Will you like that? Okay. Uh, Linhart. Worried that my parents will have to adopt a child to do their best to have another of their own if I don't carry on the family title. They should adopt Casper! <laughs> Yeah, chill. Okay. Yeah, you like chilling. That's funny. Okay, not this, not right now. Ignatz, let me guess, you are admiring the glory and splendor of the church. With the whole monastery preparing for the goddess's rite of rebirth this month, it feels like everyone's a little on edge. Look at all the folks up here this time, huh? What? Oh, poor boy. I can't stop thinking about Lenato. You gotta be the one to do it, kid. That's so messed up. Well, you did kill him. I'm sorry, Professor. I know this isn't the time, but I just can't get past it. 
I mean, to be honest, if you killed somebody, it should take you longer than, you know, a couple days to get past it. <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay, no I don't know. Happens, I promise you I'll do my Maybe part. it'd be kind of messed up to get a bond heart after that convo. I, I checked don't know. on my brother and sister, who were living in Castle Gaspar. Thankfully, they're all right. I was worried because they're both so young, but the church in the castle town offered to take them in. That hmm. much, at least, is a big relief. Okay. Flane, there's Flane. You weren't here last month, were you? Actually, I think you were. Here's an idea. Ah, that's Eloise. On the day of the rite, the monastery will be open to the public, including the Holy Mausoleum. The Holy Mausoleum is where the tomb of the Divine Saros lies. There she slumbers, eternally. That's pretty much all that's in there. Just an ancient coffin. I'm wondering why the art for these knights has black on the helmet, and there's actually no black. I wonder if they changed that in development or something and just didn't update the art. It's kind of weird. It's sealed with a powerful magic to protect against would-be grave robbers. Hmm. Professor. What's the matter? Professor, I am afraid I have acted a bit childishly toward my brother recently. Given the circumstances, I requested that he provide me with some... <laughs> Silly of me, really. The timing was improper, and I regret it very much now. He's probably stuck in the McDonald's playpen. Oh, but more importantly, this place is off limits, Professor. Yeah, so why are it you here? It's only open to the public on the day of the goddess's rite of rebirth. Okay, but you're not even a student. Don't lecture me. You're kidding. Anybody here? So I think at some point we'll be able to get renown with these statues, but it's not... I can't do anything yet, so... Not at this time. Kids are still getting... You know, months on end, you are out here disciplining children. Dang. It's a rough life, huh? You can't trust people from dusk or... Uh, such racism. Uh, item check. Fade check. Founder. There you are. You haven't moved very far in a month, my friend. Have you visited the Goddess Tower? It's a sacred place used for rituals and the like. In general, students aren't allowed entry. But as you'd expect, that rule just excites their curiosity. <laughs> Some have even tried sneaking in. Well, at least for this month, that kind of behavior is totally unthinkable. We have a lot more security, what with the Goddess's right of rebirth coming up. And I've got your mysterious notebook. Oh, this is mine. I thought it had vanished. Thanks. I owe you. And with that, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for sticking all the way through here with me. Be sure to let me know how your playthroughs are going in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time.